Today's Daily Fairy Wisdom Oracle card for September 3rd, 2023 is The Oldest Fairy. Card 25, The Oldest Fairy. Timelessness. Avoid clocks today. Too often, we view old age as a time of decline and illness. But aging has more to do with our belief systems than it has to do with the passing of time. Release all preconceived ideas of what getting older means. Keep busy. Learn everything you can. Do all the things you like to do. Challenge yourself. Do not put limitations on yourself due to age. Look at the oldest fairy. He is hundreds of years old and still growing strong. All the younger fairies come to him so he can share all the knowledge he has gained over the years. With age comes wisdom to those who choose to use their time on earth in a constructive way. So keep on living and learning and taking good care of yourself. The little ones need to have you around to tell them the old tales and to guide their fresh young minds. Every person is useful down to their very last moments on earth. Even in that last moment, one can impart wisdom. Visualize, speak, and think positively of your marvelous body. It birthed you into this world and will birth you into the next when the time is right. It gives you pleasure in many different forms and helps you learn what you came to earth to learn. Divine spirit expresses itself through your body. If you chose this card today, it may indicate that you need to spend some time with your elderly, either working with them or listening to them. If there are elders with great stories to tell, tape those stories now while they can still be captured. Make sure all that wisdom is not lost. Every person has a story and a lesson to impart. Your chant? My body is a temple wherein resides spirit. I love and appreciate my body for all the ways that it serves me. I visualize my body only in positive ways. I speak to my body only in positive ways. I speak to my body only in positive words. I think of my body only in positive way. For it is through my visualizations, speech, and thought that I tell my body how it is to react to the world around it and to the years that it resides on earth. I ask that my body be engulfed in love and joy. So be it.